and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. So we last met uh, in February, had an opportunity to review the minutes from the previous meeting. Just a bit. That was on February 6th, exactly a month ago. had a chance to look over the minutes from the previous meeting. George, you go. Yeah, go ahead and Rich. Yes, sir. Okay. Motion to approve the minutes from the previous meeting. You know, I can't, I don't think I should make any motion because I wouldn't hear them. I read them, but I don't think I could, oh. well, I could be able to okay. do that. All right. I'll second it then. Okay. I could, mm -hmm. even though I wasn't here. Mm -hmm. How do I know it's correct? I wasn't here. Got a point. You got a point. You can't by reading them. All right. Uh, report on any correspondence that we received. Well, Paul dropped off this here. I didn't get a chance, Sherry. It's just the. Uh, First National Bank uh, paperwork. Yeah. Also, this is uh, the Washington County Conservative District. Do you know what that is? What is the conservation it? District. Or conservation. Yeah. Yeah. That, is that probably their comment letter? Yes, it is. Yeah, we already received a copy of that. Okay. I'll look at it. Okay. All right. Paul wasn't sure. sure, but he told me he got it. He got it. Yeah, as long as it's the same comments that we received. Yeah, you know what? I will take this because I think this is the original application. Okay. And we'll see okay. if we need to update this. Okay. Good. Good. Anything additional, George? No, I don't have anything. Sherry. As far as correspondence. No additional correspondence. And I have none. Okay. I guess we'll move on to the treasurer's report then. Okay, well, um, it's pretty simple. We just have a bill for sharing this, this payment cycle, and our balance is $6,134.46. The last month, uh, there was $10,000 moved in. Yeah, I saw that Paul moved that money. Mm -hmm. You want that? I don't have anything. Okay. So you got something to share? I do not. Okay. We'll just, the uh, bills to be paid, we'll do that under new business then? Yes, sir. Okay. All right. Well, that's all there is to that. And motion to accept the treasurer's report. Also, I'll make a motion accept it. All right. I'll second it. Okay. Solicitor's report. Eric. Um, at the last meeting, we talked about that we were going to go through the easement list and do a, a very comprehensive review and then coordinate make that with the engineers uh, so that we were making sure we were uh, we had everybody listed properly in terms of their properties. The other thing that we uh, did in connection with that is all the drawings that have been affiliated with each property, um, they had numbers on them and it was really difficult translating that at times. So we went through and just renamed them all in our computers to create a whole new file but renamed them and made them alphabetical. Um, part of that was because we know the, uh, the guys that are going to do the appraisals, which I'll talk about in a moment, are going to need that. 
Um, so it just was something that had to be done. I mentioned it was going to be time consuming. It was, but it's been done. Um, in going through the list of easements, there were a couple of little things that were found that, um, that I exchanged. Um, and um, we, uh, uh, we have to correct a couple of the drawings because properties have been sold, for example, things like that. But we're taking care of that. But I, as Paul, I think, put in an email recently, between the two of us sitting here, I think we've really scrubbed that list down pretty well. Um, we've got it. Uh, we've got it pretty well worked out as to what sign what is and what needs to be done with each each individual one. Right. So we're ready to we're ready to move forward with that to some extent. Um, the other um, the other matter last month I did talk in executive session about some people I I had contacted about doing the appraisal work. Uh, I was able to contact a couple other people. Um, Basically, there's, it looks like there's only three that are going to potentially be interested. A few of them that I talked to were just completely blown away by the scope of this and were uh, very upfront. They didn't want to touch it? No way. They, they, that was the, the exact language I got, no way. Uh, not doing it. Uh, so, um, that because of the the nature of it, we'll talk about a little more in a brief executive session after we take care of all our regular business. Right. Um, and uh, that's really all I have except for that in the executive session. If there's any questions about, about any of this. Okay. All right. Uh, I have a motion to accept the solicitor's report. I'll make a motion to accept it. All right. I'll second it. Bridge second. Very good. I'll approve, say aye. 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 Motion passes. Uh, Brian, the engineer's report. Okay, thank you. Um, under our written report, the only general update I have is that we are still working on these con conservation district comments, and we also got a review letter back from the township on the stormwater management submission. Uh, quite a few comments there, too. So. Uh, over the next 30 days or so, we'll be addressing all those comments and resubmitting uh, the applications for both. When you say comments, you just mean questions that the township has about it? Questions or things they want to see um, addressed that were not specifically called out oh, okay. in regards to their ordinance. Oh, okay. So some are clarifications, some are revisions, recalculations, corrections. Okay. That's all I have. Uh, once again, we did some work also on uh, scrubbing the list and of easements, and um, we could talk more specifically, I guess, in executive session about the categories of letters. Is that something we should hold off on? Um, I mean, I think we could talk about it a little bit now, but it, uh, the, the point was made that the, um, the letters to the people that have asked for reviews that there may be multiple letters. We had, we had drafted right. one letter, but then we, as we started looking at it a little more, one it's, generic letter. It's going to require suffice. Yeah, it's going to probably be about three or four generic letters, and then then we'll get adapted for each particular situation. But uh, you know, the actual content of that and and what we're going to do with that, we can get into more in executive session. Okay, very good. Yeah, that was my understanding. Paul and uh, Brian had talked about that, and perhaps you were involved in that as well, Eric. The, I was hearing five separate categories, I, I perhaps think, as think many as may five. Be five, yes. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. All right. Anything additional, Brian? Is that all I have. A motion to accept the engineer's report. I'll make a motion to accept the engineer's report. All right. I'll second it. All in favor, say aye. 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 Opposed? Pass. All right. Brings us to citizens' comments. Anyone, Anyone anything from you today? Again, I commend you for coming out in this cold weather. Mm -hmm. I wish we had more involved citizens like you that took an interest in, in what's going on. All right. I'll move on to old business now. Uh, it's certainly no secret 
uh, that we continue to have a board vacancy and we continue to look for a fifth board member and uh, any of you that, that uh, are interested uh, well, we'd certainly love to hear from you <clears throat> all right the other old business we've already touched upon that is the letter on the easements the various categories which which we will get into non-signers full discussions etc an executive session which we plan to do here coming up shortly um, the Act 13 state grants, can we apply? Um, Brian, was that something you were going to look into? Uh, I have not. Done, that's the one that you sent out. I have not done anything further on that. Um, okay. I can make note of that and we'll can do it. Okay. All right, well, we can discuss that further, too. Any other old business? Anyone's aware of? I don't have any brought up. All right move on to new business then first off to approve the bills that need paid George by Sherry Crawford uh, $203.25 for uh, attending meetings preparing minutes and, and mailings and emails and reimbursement for marriage yes it's two hundred three twenty-five. right that's all I have this month. Just one of them. Nobody said any bills on it. Our, uh, we were talking about that, Sherry and I are my bookkeepers away. And I see. So she, uh, it was just the timing of it that she was away at the time these usually go out. So I'm she'll sure get them out good. next week, we'll deal with it next month. I'm sure. Yeah. I'm sure they'll be, they'd be double. <laughs> it will actually be a little large because of all that work I talked about. Yes, dealing with the uh, easement list and such. Yeah, we can hardly wait. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay, um, that's it then. This is the bill for Sherry. Yes. All right. A motion to approve the payment of uh, the bill for uh, Sherry Crawford. I, I can make that motion. All right. I'll second it. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Pass. Okay. You get paid. Yes. Thank you, sir. <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> uh, second uh, course of business that Paul had here was to approve a uh, line of credit funds transfer if needed. I think that's been taken care of. I don't think yeah, we, we need don't to. Need I don't think we need to address that. We don't need anything that, right now. No, yeah, no, I think no. we're good. Okay, we can pass over on that. Yeah. So um, anyway, that that brings us uh, uh, through the agenda. 